So this video is going to concentrate more on Cameo, the giant schnauzer, his nutrition rather than the obedience. In order for a dog, I would say to train well, he needs to eat good as well. And this is treading the territory of species appropriate food. It could make people uncomfortable, but raw food for a carnivore that's species appropriate food, that's the way it's supposed to go. So this video, I'm going to concentrate on what I feed Cameo, what I feed my dogs and Cameo came raw fed right off the bat already. So this board and train was very seamless. I understood his nutrition because I am a nutritionist for the raw diet specifically. So anyone that has any questions, please leave them in the comments and I would love to answer and go over them and maybe create a new video just on the questions that you guys ask me. Now specifically what I want to show you is a little bit more of an advance but not so much of an event. This shouldn't be a guideline to feed your dogs. I will go over in the future how to do that. Right now, I want to concentrate on the meal that I have prepared for a cameo. And this is species appropriate food. So right now we have chicken feet. We have pork boneless, uh, pork boneless stew and another pork boneless stew. So this is double. Now I'm going to cut them up. And the idea is we want to feed and you Cameo had a very nice training session today. We went on the subway station, so now he's gonna get fed for that. And on the subway station, you know, we usually use a high quality kibble. I'll go over another video on what we use for training. But in this video, I want to concentrate on what I'm about to give Cameo to maintain his nutrition. So we have chicken feet and a plastic bag here which is fine we put it there the chicken feet is going to give him calcium is going to give him phosphorus it's going to give him a lot of nutrition covering from a to zinc the boneless pork stew this is boneless this is red meat pork is an excellent red meat to feed um, it's very lean these pieces so not a problem and I'm going to give him a little bit more of the pork show, uh, uh, the, the boneless pork stew. Sorry, I do feed pork shoulder as well. So this would be a pretty good ration, I would say. And I'm going to get rid of some of the chicken feet here. And we have chicken feet. We have this. I would say this is good. So now I would like to show you how... Cameo is gonna gobble this up. Not a problem. Any questions, you leave them in the comment section. I will answer them. I'm a nutritionist. I specialize in the raw diet. So this board and train was very, very, very good for me. I was able to feed him a species appropriate food and do the training at the same time. You want your dog to have a healthy, long, smart, clear headed life species appropriate food is the way to go and he did eat all of the red meat no interest in the chicken feet interesting maybe he'll go back to it i don't know ah. no no now why do you think he ate the red meat first well, I'll tell you, because the red meat is very tasty, and chicken is very bland. It doesn't taste like anything. We use chicken for edible bone, and the red meat we use so that we can get the dog his adequate vitamins, minerals, proteins. Everything red meat associated is going to taste much better. And then now he goes 
and he starts eating the chicken feet. With the chicken feet, he's gonna get his calcium, he's gonna get his phosphorus. He's gonna get his glucosamine. And this is all natural, species appropriate food. This is a giant schnauzer, this is cameo, this is our boarding train, and he did come to us raw fed. So usually in the wild, I would say a little bit of facts, if this was wild dogs, domestic dog in the wild, a wolf, a carnivore, the mother is gonna hunt, the mother will have a litter, and then as the pups wean on the milk, they will get off the milk and the mother will start to bring in solid foods into the den and the pub start to eat the solid foods and the milk at the same time. So I get a lot of people that say, oh, my dog is too young to eat the raw food and things like that. It's totally not true. Raw foods is species appropriate food. And if a lot more people went this route, there wouldn't be so much problems with dogs, you know? So leave them in the comment section, any questions, I would love to answer them. And I hope everyone has a very good weekend. And go watch Doctor Strange and came out. That's the last of the chicken feet. And he's going to sleep very well today. Giant schnauzer puppy, he's about five months. There we go.